Yeah, what's up? I'm Anson Richardson. I'm born in uh, Brooklyn, New York. Um, family, first generation American. Family's from Trinidad. Um, grew up in, um, uh, moved to Kendall, Miami when I was eight years old and um, spent most of my time there, including college in uh, Florida State. Uh, I kind of just call myself an artist. Um, and that encompasses uh, filmmaking, acting, writing, illustration, um, etc. Um, I think what, what I'm most known for right this second is uh, writing for this series called The Boys on Amazon Prime, a little screwed up superhero show. But there was there was the acting, there was the, the, the films that went to Sundance, um, film earlier last year that that won at um, uh, London Sci-Fi, which is great that I was acting in, um, you know, uh, my, my run on NCIS Los Angeles. Um, what to call uh, my last show, uh, NBC's Timeless, which was which was fantastic, and then what I'm really really excited about are the projects coming up now. Um, and there's 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 two things plus a third that landed in my lap this year that is blew my mind when I realized that that was what the meeting was about. At the time. What was called the middle school was a school called RR Moat. Um, it was an art school, but I only was I was only there for a year, so it was uh, I think I was there for sixth grade, and and then from there I went to Southwood um, for seventh, eighth, and ninth. I was in in Southwood and like you know doing the art, you know um, painting. Uh, uh, sculpture, etc. And we had heard that there's this new school. It just a lot of the, a lot of uh, my friends from Southwood came into um, Dash, and it was I don't know something about it just seemed like an adventure. To me, the best part of being there was kind of what attracted me there to begin with. It was this this new this new thing that people sort of had an idea about but they didn't know exactly. And, and what I loved was that we were sort of like the first, we were like the, the guinea pigs. And they were learning as, as we were progressing from, from um, you know, uh, uh, 10th, 11th and 12th. And I love the freedom um, of that. Um, I'm not a very structured person. <laughs> I like, you know, things to kind of go, you know, all over the place and ideas to kind of come at me. Um, you know, learning about philosophy and and and, and these, these incredible conceptual drawing classes. And at one point, me and I think three other friends talked to um, the people across the street. I don't think it was um, Roche, Roche Bobois. I don't think that was them, but it was some other thing there and they had an empty, third floor or second or something that they hadn't filled out. And we were just like, can we make it our studio? And they're like, yeah, cool. And so it was just three teenagers who were there up all through the nights, just doing paintings and, and doing all that. And that was the experience with it. It was just this, this it's just art, 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 art. And um, without, without borders, <laughs> art without borders and boundaries. Um, and I, I love that and I've taken that with me um, through the rest of my career. Dash is for me, um, and I'm pretty sure it's still, it's an experience. Yes, you can probably go to a school that's closer. It's kind of like, you know, going to, going to college. Mm -hmm. You can go to your local community college, you know, or if you're in Miami, you can go to University of Miami, but there's nothing like going away and feeling like you're moving from one space into another. It allows your, your mind to sort of take greater risks than, than you would have normally taken. You know, kind of like, you know, like a child, you know, the child who stays home is a different child than the one who, you know, becomes a road scholar and is traveling around the world and coming back um, with that. Now, yes, certain, I'm sure, probably certain education things may overlap, but, I'll never forget, yes, waking up early, 
sometimes I'm working on floor plans. I was working on floor plans and, and, and renderings all through the night, but having to wake up early, go to the Metro Rail, <laughs> you know, um, then on the Metro Rail, you know, you're going and you're talking and you're interacting um, with people. You're, you're, you're getting more and more like um, influences and, and inspirations um, for a person like me who have gone on to, to filmmaking and, and, um, and entertainment career, all of that is vital. You know what I mean? All of that has just allowed me to just get like stimuli from all types of different places, listening to what people were talking about, having that conversation, um, you know, before work, you know, um, and then, you know, before work, it was like work, <laughs> before school and then coming home from school. Uh, I, I, I think it, it 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 allows you your, it will allow your child to mature in a different way, um, and almost like they're going off to college each day. Um, yeah, I I, I I I there's nothing about the the dash experience that that I regret even in the slightest. It was just it was perfect. I I I, I have thought often of like if I had gone to a regular school or whatever, where would I be today? And I wouldn't be here. So, how does your dash success story start? <laughs>